Good morning, my peepers. Welcome to Shaleen's Creativity Room. It is Wednesday, June 14th. What's going on today? Yep, June 14th. I forgot to grab my planners. Okay. What did I do yesterday? Um, let's see if there's birthdays first to June. Nope. No birthdays today. Yesterday. Um, I was in a Zoom last night. Cross-stitching. I think I was in there till 11 o'clock, which with that group, I'm not usually in there that late because I usually have to get up in the morning, but I'm not babysitting right now. So, yeah, um, Dylan said that everything went well with the girlfriend's son putting the boys on the bus. And Dylan said that um, this summer he is dropping them off here. So, cool. Cool beans. Okay, book. I finished Melody of a Curse. I give it four stars. It didn't give me all the feels. All the feels give you a five star. Melody of a Curse gives you the good feelings that you don't want to put it down you want to know what happens all of that i started so far what i started is a three star do i want to finish it yes because i want to know what's going on so it's so the book yesterday was melody of a curse by, what was it, Jenna, Jenna Gath, I can't remember, I don't have it written down here, it's in my phone, okay, so I have Book Mori app on my phone, I love it, okay, book calendar, I just want to see it. Jana Ruth. It's a contemporary 12 dancing princesses retelling. I never read the 12 princesses. 12 dancing princesses. Never heard of them. Never heard of them. It must be maybe a story out of the United States. I don't know. But I really enjoyed it. It's like a fantasy, contemporary romance. This blood orange. I'll show you. I got this from Grand Central, I believe. Yeah, Grand Central Publishing. It came out February 2019. I got it as an ARC. This is an ARC copy. Harriet Tice. First of all, I don't like cheating. So when there's cheating in the in a book, I pretty much don't care for it. Especially when the woman that's cheating has like a five-year-old daughter, six-year-old daughter, and she has a good life, and she's screwing it up. But if I'm in page what? 119. I've got that much read. I don't know about her husband either. I, we don't know much about him. We follow her. She is a lawyer. So she works a lot of hours. But she's cheating with another lawyer who treats her like shit. But her husband is also not the nicest person. So, 
the only time I have really gotten into a book if it had cheating is if one of them is cheating because the spouse is a monster. But even then, it's like, get out of it. So I have a hard time with that. And she drinks a lot when she should be home with her daughter. So, yeah, I, I'm having a hard time with this book so far. Like I said, it's a three star. And it's not because of the writer's style. It's because of the content. And I don't like that kind of content. I like it when you're not married and you're still in college, you're going out drinking with your friends. No, she should be home at night with her husband and her daughter and she's out in the bars getting trashed. That's what I have a problem with. That's just me. Some people don't mind reading that, but yeah. So I will finish it. And um, I'm trying to dwindle down my physical, my TBR physical pile, which I'm getting there. Okay, what else yesterday? Um, I cross-stitched, did not watch any TV, but um, Hade Dragon, Treasure, whatever. Stocking. Okay. And, oh, I went to Target. I needed to get some, I needed to get Dawn and some paper plates. We, we always use paper plates all year long. And I'm like, you know what? I can wash the dishes. It's just the two of us. So I stopped buying paper plates a couple months ago but with the warmer weather I don't wash the dishes quite as much if it's too warm in the kitchen so I bought paper plates and I needed um, laundry booster scent I needed some of that what else I needed napkins I was all out of napkins so I got that um, yeah some soups some sparkling waters, so things like that I got. Oh, and I bought me two pretty shirts for the summer and a pair of shorts. So, yeah, that's that's what I did yesterday at Target. Um, let's get on to today. What did... Because I didn't watch anything yesterday to talk about. I talked about the books. So let's get on to today. And I didn't bring in the um, dragon. I did only put in 380 stitches. But that's okay. Today's weather. It is not going to be nice out today. It's supposed to be a high of 60 and a low of 53. And it's raining now. And it says rain. Thunder possible. Oh my God, I would love a good thunderstorm. Winds northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Chance of rain 100%. Humidity, 86% and sunset, 852. Now, my severe weather is in red. Let me see what it says. I don't think it's for here. Anyways, it is raining. Hold on. Okay. Rain, rain, rain. Rain, rain. So, 
So I don't think I got any cleaning in yesterday, but I will today. I do want to clean the bathroom. I do want to sweep the kitchen floor. I want to do dishes. I don't have many, but I want to get them done. Today is um, my Wednesday crafting Zoom. I didn't know if I was going to be able to have it because I did not have enough on my credit card for it. And I really didn't have money to put on my credit card. But um, I only needed $10 more on my credit card to pay for my Zoom. So um, I did have that in the checking account. So yesterday I put that on and this morning I checked and it was put onto my credit card so I hurried up and paid it this morning. <coughs> I hate that when you're short a couple dollars. <coughs> okay. Do, do, do. National Day. Yes, and I'm getting them back in my email. National Day. So today is National Flag Day. So it's Flag Day. And Army Birthday. Army birthday. Let's put that in too. Okay, so today we have Zoom. Wednesday crafting. Oh, and at, I believe it's 7.30 Eastern time. I will be live on... Rebecca's channel, what is it, Crafts, you know I'm going to forget it, Crafting and Crime Daily, is that hers? You know I'm always forgetting the channel name, because she changed it, see if I can find it, do, 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 yeah, Crafting and Crime Daily. So I'm going to be coloring with her, so look out for that. And I will probably try to put it on my channel too like I usually do. Okay, now wisdom quote, wisdom quote, those who do not weep do not see by Victor Hugo. In word of the day, word, word, word of the day, word, 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 word of the day. Today's word is chirk. It's a verb to cheer, to make a shrill noise, or as an adjective, lively and cheerful. And the other word of the day is Amuse gull. Amuse gull. It's a noun. A small savory item of food served as an appetizer before a meal. I thought that was an appetizer. Oh, it's a certain kind of appetizer. Never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about. And the horoscope for today for Aries. 
Emotionally, you should feel good today, so don't let this confidence go to waste. Do things with your sweetheart and turn the dial up on romance. Your inner light is shining brightly, so know that you can use this to illuminate the path for others. Offer a sympathetic ear and comforter shoulder for someone to cry on tonight. People will be drawn to you like steel to a magnet. Okay. Here we go. So there is that. Yes. <clears throat> Morning video. and 380 stitches yesterday. I will be stitching again today because it is my second Whipco piece. And I never wrote down the Whipco in here. Wow, that's weird. I always write that down. I know I did in May. Yeah, Whipco. I will do that in a second. Let me finish writing in here. So yesterday it was stocking, treasure dragon, so my goal next year is to work in a horizontal start nothing new except if it's from what is it the stitchy witcher stitchy witch if she has a stitch lawn you know I always want to do hers other than that I'm not starting anything new I'm not buying anything except for floss when I need it the only thing that I want to buy next year is I want to start buying different brands of sticker books instead of Happy Planner. I have a lot of Happy Planner still. I'm still going through them. I'm starting to weed through them. If I've used them a lot already, they're going in a pile to give to someone. And I want to get a few others. Um, I can't think of the names of the top of my head. The one I already have a book for. I know there's a few others. I really, really want to try their sticker books. I don't know if they ever go on sale. I'll find out. But, um, yeah. I want to start changing some things up and make things easier for me. So, like I said, I'm going to be down to one planner next year. It'll be the horizontal. And I'm going to be using these all the time, but it's weekly instead of daily. I'm doing it weekly. So, like, I write where it says top three at the top here. I'm putting in all the chores for the week. And then just check them off when I do them. And if I write dishes, then next to it I'll write, I'll do an M, T, W, T, H. Whatever days I do the dishes on, the same thing with the laundry and the vacuuming. I will write in here what I'm stitching on for the week, what I'm reading for the week. And my Sirius XM, I try to listen to a different station every day, so I will put that in here. Um, if there's any TV shows that I'm watching that week, I will put that on there. Because, and I only use one side, and then the next week I use the other side. So it gets used. It gets used. Coffee is all gone. Okay, stock and treasure dragon. We worked on it yesterday, which was the 13th. 23. Okay, let's go back into June because I did not write in here. Oh, and Gairan Tatten Bags on their Facebook group. 
this month's designer of the month is cottage garden sampling see this is another thing i want to do next year i'm thinking this is my thought how like uh, ron cotton bags does that i want to start doing that here on my channel and with my zoom group i'm going to pick a designer for the month and that's who we can focus on for the month after our whip go pieces. Okay, this month, number four. I have lots of ideas. Because I so far I have not had a finish this year and I need some finishes. So the next five years, yeah. But, um, yeah, let's see, number four was Lawn Dog. And then number 16 is my Haid Stuck in Treasure Dragon. Okay. And I think when I'm done with this video, I am going to do my floss tube. I am so far behind on my floss tube, it's not even funny. Yeah. Okay, so there's June. I used to put in a lot more on this, but next year I think is where I'm going to write down more stitch alongs and stuff like that because um, with starting all the things and that, this year it kind of worked a little bit differently. There's nothing special going on this weekend except Sunday, which is Father's Day, but it's also Lawn Dog Zoom. And the only reason Lawn Dog Zoom is Sunday is because the 23rd, 24th, and 25th is my Crustage Weekend Zoom. And I probably could have done Lawn Dog Zoom in there, but I didn't. Okay. So, yeah, there's June. I want, and I know I can get them at the Dollar Tree, I want a, um, a planner that just has the months in it like that, the monthly. That's all I want for next year. And I used to buy them all the time in the Dollar Tree, and um, I would write down all the TV shows that are, you know, the new shows, new movies. I would write that in there. So I want that for next year. And I can write the TV shows, what Zooms. I can write all these when it's um, a cross-stitch weekend, a readathon weekend. Whenever there's anything special going on, like um, when a drop comes in for a stitch along, I can write that in. There is just so much that I like to do. I can put in what serious station for the month. So I really, really like that idea. Either that or, or I buy a planner for like $3 like I do when they're on clearance. Either an undated or one that's dated and I just redate it. I take out all the innards and just use that. I mean, there, but I'd rather just pay a dollar at the Dollar Tree. And I do see that they are on Timu, but I can get them for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. So like I said, I'll just keep buying more of these type of things and um, I will buy the horizontal and the notebook for next year. I have ideas. I do, I do. Um, don't have much else going on. I know I got paid. Didn't I write it down? It's weird. I always write it down when I get paid. Oh, okay. That's why. April, May, June. 
Okay, that's it for today. I am still going and looking at all my fabric I have sitting here and um, the projects that I'm planning on stitching on this year. Like I said, I have, I'm hoping that Deborah Bryan and I go next week to the cross stitch store because I need a piece of fabric before the 25th. I need, yeah, I need a piece of fabric for the 25th, July 1st, July 29th, and July 30th. And I already have the money for that. And then I have more fabric here, plus the fabric. What did I do with the fabric Kaya gave me? I just bought fabric. Oh, there it is. So I got the fabric from Kaya. I got the fabric. I, I just, I got to pay her. I got the fabric from Drea. I found this. And I got this 28 count gridded that I'm going to try one over one. I think I can do it. So I have fabric. And I have another small pile of fabric. So, um, yeah. All the new starts. All the new things. So I will talk about them in my floss tube as well. So yes, you will hear this again. But that's it for today, my peepers. I hope that you have a great day. And um, I hope your weather is a little bit better than it has been here. So I will see you guys in my floss tube video. Love you all. Bye.